The SPC 300 comes complete with all software and drivers for both PC and Mac. The software allows you to make on-screen annotations, control your SPC 300 with your computer, capture still images, and record live video and audio. To install the software, first insert the disk into your computer's CD drive. Follow the prompts and you'll be ready to go in minutes. Once installed, connect the included USB cable to your SPC 300 and to your computer. Double click on the Abrevision software icon and the application will open. On the bottom left of the window, you will see a list of icons. From left to right, these icons allow you to open the document camera controls, open the annotation controls, open the video recording controls, transfer images to a computer, and capture images directly to your computer. To access the document camera controls, click on the camera icon. Upon opening the document camera controls, you will see a similar function layout as is on the SPC 300 main control panel. Click on any of these controls to use your desired effects. To access the annotation controls, click on the pencil icon. This will open a window that will include all annotation functions and will allow you to make notes, drawings, and more to the live image. The top buttons allow you to add text, draw lines, draw freehand, erase, insert a box, or insert a circle or oval. The bottom buttons allow you to change the color, line width, eraser size, and fill or shade color. Once a tool is selected, you can write or draw anything directly to the live image. To access the video recording controls, click on the videotape icon. This will open a window including all video recording functions. Remember, if you want to record audio with your video, you will need a built-in microphone on your computer or plug one into your mic port of your computer. Please note, the SPC 300 does not come with a microphone. To begin recording, click on the red dot in the top section of the control circle. You will be prompted to name the file and select a location for the video to be saved. Once completed, the video will start recording and you will see the timer begin. To stop recording, click on the gray square in the bottom area of the circle. To view previously saved video, Click on the pull-down menu from the playlist and choose. Then, simply click on the right arrow in the center of the control circle to play back previously recorded video. You can also fast forward by clicking on the right arrow on the right side of the control circle. Be sure your speakers are turned on when replaying video to hear the audio. Finally, you can capture images and save them directly to your computer by clicking on the camera icon. Once you click the icon, the image has been captured. It will then prompt you asking where you want the image to be saved and what you would like to name the file. Once you complete these steps, the image will be stored in the folder you specified.